Hey all, so I'm just trying to record a little bit more random things that I'm doing <clears throat> throughout the day to get my blogging more consistent. So with keto lifestyle, of course, you always have some healthy oils, typically meats, but you can also do keto without meat, but a bit more difficult. I love ground beef. I eat ground beef, but I try to balance my meats. Ground beef is a bit on that type of fat from the ground beef can irritate my stomach sometimes if I have too much of it, <clears throat> especially without having a gallbladder. So I do ground turkey. I do ground chicken. I got to check to see if we have some sofrito and recaito. I do. I see it. So let's see. What do we have? I do lots of herbal teas. I see it. So this is what I'm going to put in here. So I, my mom makes these Spanish beans and rice that are so delicious that are like no one's, like I haven't ever tasted anyone else's Spanish beans and rice that tastes like my mom's. Anyway, she puts Goya's recaito and she puts Goya's um, sofrito in it and her beans and rice. But I'm actually... I used to only limit myself to beans and rice with this seasoning, but it, I mean, it's, it's, I mean, with this base, but it's so good. Like it tastes, even though it's canned, it tastes so fresh. Green peppers, onions, cilantro. I did not know that was, wow. Okay. And garlic and olive oil. It says for rice, beans, soups, chili, and stews, but obviously don't limit yourself to whatever's on the label. But yeah, slow carb. Look at that. Total carbs. Zero. And recaito. Goya's recaito. Again, it says it's only for rice, beans, soups, chili, and stews. Nope, I'm putting it in my tacos. And I'm also going to actually um, look at that. Zero carbs. I'm actually going to put this. I'm going to put this, this, and this with a little bit more seasoning. And then I'm going to make stuffed peppers with just this and cheese and the pepper. No rice, of course, or anything else with the carbs. Um, and I just love those. Like I can just, I love low carb stuff, peppers. Like I love them. Now peppers themselves, uh-uh, that's rude. Peppers themselves aren't on, um, well, obviously peppers don't have labels, but <clears throat> let me make sure I have peppers still. Yeah, so peppers themselves aren't low carb. Watch out, London. Of course, Mommy, look. Get it, get you're being rude. rude. Be quiet. Peppers themselves aren't low carb, or low. They aren't the lowest carb vegetable. But again, I'm not too too strict with it because I actually do carbs. Um, I do like keto cycling and a low carb cycling type thing where I have low carbs sometimes and most of the time keto most of the time, and I allow myself to have carbs other than other times. So it's more of a long term lifestyle for me. So anyways, yeah, peppers aren't the lowest carb vegetable, but they can still fit into a keto plan. Um, ooh, that one is bad. That's why I had to check them. I was like, do I even have peppers down here? They've been down here for like a week. <clears throat> so anyways, that's what I'm doing. Toodles.